Why? Because we are one family. Would you say the same about your brother or sister? It's not my responsibility. My brother is not doing well at school. It's not my responsibility. I'm not going to help him study. He should study by himself. My sister is not doing... Or is, my sister is not feeling well. She can't afford going to the hospital and getting a medicine. Well, it's not my responsibility. I'm not going to help her. She should do a better job in getting money. No, nobody says that. I mean, of course, actually, unfortunately, some people do say that, but that's not my point. I'm not talking about exceptions. I'm talking about So I think my message is clear. I hope it is. And it's as bright as the shining sun that I'm looking at right now. This is who we are. We are one. We are brothers and sisters all over the world, no matter how many people we grow and populate to be. Seven billion, eight, in the future if we reach ten, does not make a single difference. Once we accept love as the greatest source and power, in the universe, in our consciousness, we will understand and look at each other as equals and as siblings. And of course, as humans, we will go through certain experiences that will bring doubt to us, that will bring fear, that will bring hate. But once you're aware and you're conscious that Whenever you have any negative thoughts, you will stop for a moment and think, why am I having these thoughts? Why am I feeling this resentment towards this person or another? Or this group of people or another? When you ask yourself why, and when you start analyzing and reading and researching, that's when I say, Stop being ignorant of the other. That's when you accept them. And experience is everything. No matter how much you read about a certain group of people, you will not truly sympathize with them unless you know someone from that group of people. And I'm now talking in terms of, I'm also now separating and differentiating others, but I'm only saying this in context to prove an idea or to make an example. So when you want to get to know, for example, people who are from a certain race or country, befriend one and become friends with one. And the funny thing is that the last thing you will get from this, you'll, you'll reach one conclusion. And one conclusion only, I guarantee you. There is nothing different between you and him or her. If you realize you are just the same, you had good parents who raised you well, who taught you well, taught you about respect and love and caring and being the best person you can be and this is shared between all of us travel and you will see Get out of your comfort zone, meet new people. And you will see how we are all one and the same. 
So until next time.